Did you know the budget of the Titanic movie was higher than the cost of the actual ship? The Titanic's construction cost about $7.5 million in 1912, which equates to approximately $180 million today, while the film cost $200 million to produce in 1997. The scenes set in 1912, the year the ship sank, have a total length of 2 hours and 40 minutes, the exact time it took for Titanic to sink. Gloria Stewart, who played Rose at 101 years old, was the only person on the set who was actually alive in 1912. The grand staircase on the ship was faithfully reconstructed, but it was flooded and destroyed on the first take. There were no backups for the scene. The hands seen sketching Rose were not Leonardo DiCaprio's, but director James Cameron's. The scene was filmed in a mirror image and then reversed in post-production. To get a realistic crowd reaction during the sinking scene, the extras were only told they were filming a sinking scene, but not specifically what they were going to encounter. James Cameron went on more dives to the Titanic wreck than the actual captain of Titanic. He made 12 dives, whereas Captain Edward John Smith went down with the ship on its maiden voyage. The film crew only had one shot at the first-class lounge flooding scene because the entire set and furnishings were going to be destroyed. During the shoot, someone spiked the cast and crew's lobster chowder with PCP. 80 people were taken ill, and more than 50 were hospitalized with hallucinations. The I'm the King of the World line was not scripted. It was improvised by Leonardo DiCaprio, but Cameron liked it so much that he decided to keep it in the movie. I'm the king of the world! 